And this video will show how our knowledge of the Excel financial functions makes it easy to calculate the payments on an adjustable rate mortgage, which many of you may have. So let's consider a 30-year adjustable rate mortgage with monthly payments. So there are 360 months of payments. And in year one, we know the payments will be at 8%. Years two through five, the payments will be at a rate of 12%, 15%, 17%, and 17%. This is based on what interest rates become. And we have a starting balance. We owe $60,000 on the loan. So what will we pay the uh, first 12 months? And the, and the rates reset, uh, the payment resets at the beginning of each year, I should have said. So we'll figure out the payments that we would make each month for five years. Okay. So the payment would be, okay, we would take 8% divided by 12. That's the rate. There are 360 months left and we borrowed 60,000. The minus sign makes the payment positive. That's just like what we've been doing on regular mortgages. Now, what goes to principal? Because we need to get the ending balance because basically the payment the second year will depend on that. So the principal will be 8% divided by 12. Okay. And then you would take, we have 360 months left on this loan. And then basically months, we're in the first 12 months, that's what goes to principal, $501. The ending balance, we just take the starting balance minus 501. Then in year two, we have a starting balance here. Okay, now what will be the payment the second year? Well, we've got this new rate of 12%, and we've got this starting balance, but there's only 348 months left. That's the key. So we'll take 12% divided by 12 is the rate. We've got 348 months left, and we've got basically a balance of 59, 498, 78. The minus sign makes the payment positive. Now the principal, basically, again, we're doing months 1 through 12. This new rate divided by 12. Okay, 348 months left again. And then basically the starting balance is 59, 498, and we take a minus. Okay, so then what goes to principal the second year will be $244, which is much less because there's a higher rate. There. So our ending balance is this. We just copy these formulas down, and then we will have what the starting balance is every year through year five, what the payment is. The payments go up a lot as the rates go up, and this is what's happened in 2008. Many people got adjustable rate mortgages pre-2008 at low rates, and then they got clobbered when the rates went up as they sort of had to go. Uh, eventually, what goes down must come up, as they say. And then the principal here, the contribution would go down for a while, and then it would come back up on the rates drop. So that's how you can figure out the payments on adjustable rate mortgages very easily when you understand the PMT function and the cum prince function. Okay, so thanks for watching, and, and there's a free course, a free 21-day course from Dr. Winston, um, and all of these videos are coming from one of three books. So first, this one, which you can see here at the top of the screen, um, Microsoft's book, which has 355 reviews, uh, and then it's, let's see, 4.6 stars. Um, it's coming from this book as well, his marketing analytics book, which is down here, and you can sort of see 4.5, or his newest book, his analytics stories book which is here, and with that one, you can see it's four point something, or maybe even five. I don't think it's five. Yeah, 4.8. And so, yeah, anyways, in the description, there's a free 21-day course from Dr. Winston, um, or you can go to excelwithwayne.com slash free, and it'll be there. But again, thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, just uh, please let us know. Thanks.